Hello everybody, welcome to the CCL Playoffs 45 round of 64 match between a large thud and his Pro Elves and Le Marcelet and his Dark Elves. In the booth with me is Faimir and Skurumeto. Hello! Hello everyone, how are we doing tonight? Hello, uh, whatever you are watching, Dean, I hope you're having a nice day. Indeed, the, the ramp up to this match has been legendary. We've been waiting for such a long time. Jim almost forgot the two names of the coaches in the intro. <laughs> no, I never know the names of the two coaches in the intro. I have to wait until it appears on the screen. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, here we are. We've got some, uh, some Dark Elves against some Pro Elves. Jim, talk us through these teams. Yeah, a large thud must be the lower TV because he's got a bribe. Oh, no, they've both got a bribe from the kickoff result. There is a babe, so Le Marcelet had the lower TV and has a babe. Uh, the, the kickoff, of course, was um, get the ref. Uh, let's have a look at the teams. Le Marcelet's got Dark Elves. Ooh, this is bad, isn't it? You would have really loved dodge on this blitzer. Only edge five and not dodge is a bit rubbish. Um, got a wrestle witch. Lodge step juggernaut, hit the old juggernaut witch there, so he's gone for a surfy witch. He's got a strength four, guard, move. It's not that exciting, is it? The pro seem a bit better, I think. The pro seem a bit better. We've got uh, lots of stats. Look at this strength five yeah. catcher. Wow, I wish I had a strength five catcher. That seems amazing. <laughs> <laughs> move up sidestep catcher with Bludge. Edge four, move nine catcher. Absolute stat freaks of death there. Unbelievable. And then also a guard wow. 90, or two more guards. Yeah, this is a pretty incredible Pro Elf team, isn't it? And 12 players, yes. too. It's what? pretty good. Definitely pretty good. Um, I just spent the last 30 seconds being like, wow, these guys are playing like it's Blitz Pit. They're playing so fast. And then I realized, like, yes, we're, not we're, live. <laughs> we will catch up not in like the replay. It. Yeah, yeah. This, this match is ongoing. Um, so we will be in the replay, and then eventually we will catch up. I just want to say I can tell how much mental energy it takes for you to press the press the record button that to, <laughs> when you when you do these recordings because you can never remember what the kickoff result was. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just like staring at the button, like okay, don't miss, don't forget to not record. <laughs> thanks, thanks, Guru. Yep, that's exactly yeah. what it's like. <laughs> Uh, you're, you're. I know, I know how it goes. We're just gonna, we're just gonna, you know, show the man behind the curtain briefly there. <laughs> Ooh, I don't, the, like uh, the... <laughs> I don't like this. That was we... easy to get an extra hit, wasn't it? Easy. Sure was. We had your classic turn one, edge five, fail to pick up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. God, I had an edge five that like rolled a one every time. It was unbelievable. No, I mean it's a, it's like, it's like it's hard coded in. Like, Edge Five can do a lot of incredible things. It cannot pick up the ball clean. <laughs> oh, Dio. Dio, what, this. <laughs> yes. What's the deal with the uh, Strength Five Elves this season? For God's sake. Yeah, there's been a lot of Strength of Elves, an, un, an unrealistic amount of Strength of Elves in, yeah. in the Chalice. Um, uh, one less now after the last game we watched, huh? Yeah, two less. No spoilers on that. Was it Jim? Was it someone else? <laughs> Find out only on YouTube. <laughs> or, like, any VOD on Twitch, I guess. Yep. Or Discord. People probably talk about it. Yep. <laughs> Other people's channels everywhere, really. <laughs> oh, oh, yes, 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 yes. Exclusively on YouTube. <laughs> I should have probably said what channel, though. <laughs> JimmyFantastic.com. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to everyone if the uh, if the commentary isn't nearly X-rated enough for you. Uh, <laughs> we'll try and step it up a notch to compete with the last uh, commentary. Team. Oh my God! I wonder if that was too much. <laughs> I thought I thought it was a little too much. Again, I, I'm a little biased because I'm sitting in a room with someone named Tree. Hearing all of that. Well, let's wait it's until Tree watch the board and then uh, we can decide. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Yeah. Fair. Absolutely fair. Oh dear. Yeah. Yeah. I can always just ask her if she gives a shit. That's not a bad idea, is it? <laughs> wow. Well. It's never a bad idea to just ask people if they give a shit. Yeah, yep. but yes. 
I definitely agree, but there is a world in which people feel pressured to give an answer that they maybe are not as comfortable with as the answer implies. Yeah. Yeah. 100% sure Tree is not one of those persons. Yeah. I, I don't know Tree at all. I've, yeah. I, have, I don't think I've ever watched her stream. Uh, don't worry, she's nice, but yeah. yeah. Also has a funny side, so yeah, I, I don't think she's gonna take it, uh, but... Uh, Tree's, Tree's match was just cast, Dato Quest, yeah. I don't know about Enzo's. I don't no, think so. Enzo's hasn't been yet. No, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of uh, replays to get through. Um, so yeah, there'll be there'll be some replays after this. Probably no, no among us. Probably not. <laughs> the com <laughs> the commentary team went a little off the rails in the last match that uh, was cast on this channel. Yeah, there was nothing. Oh, there was nothing mean is, said. Yeah. There was nothing mean no, said about no, you. No. There was, there was Certainly some, not. there was some mean things said about Nooms's coaching ability, but the main thing was yes, there was lots of like it was it was quite X-rated, but not really actually X-rated. No, but was it just was like, just innuendo. It yeah. was heavy-handedly innuendo laden, which is sometimes a boon <laughs> and sometimes a curse. <laughs> yes, yeah, it was it was pretty ridiculously over the top. So heavy-handed. <laughs> <laughs> <You know. laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. oh man, you laugh like Jabba the Hutt. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. At some point in my life, I look like Jabba the Hutt. Yeah, yeah, we all, we all, we've all been there. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was maybe a bit too much. So yeah, you know, if if you want to watch the vod, um, then you might, you know, and if you object, let us know because you know it's. Uh, I've got no problems with not putting it on YouTube, obviously, if you object. Jimmy, Jimmy's never been that fat, but he's had that many toes. I've never been, I've never been that bad at the thing. It was, it was all PC's fault. It was not my fault. <laughs> well, I was talking about comparing you to Jabba the Hutt. Oh, well, that's very nice of you, but no, I'm pretty much, I, I pretty much am Jabba the Hutt. Yeah, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> no, just, just in toe count. <laughs> oh dear. Do you count the point of his tail as a toe? Like, does he have one, or is that a none? I think it's a none. Yeah, I think it's a none too, because I called it a tail and not a hand, so or a foot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he might have feet tucked under there. I he guess. might we don't do. Really, yeah. No one can possibly know. Has anyone done an an, 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 an anatomical diagram of Jabba the Hutt? <laughs> Uh, all, I've, all, all the ones that I have done, I are uh, we really shouldn't talk about because we're trying to move away from the uh, sexual innuendo. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that in the Star Wars role-playing game, you will find that information. <laughs> we could just ask Fault Force. <laughs> oh God! Oh. That is the that is the last thing we should be doing. <laughs> That's a bit harsh, isn't oh, it? I'm but, sure there is. I'm sure there is, Grickner. Well, you can, and then I'll watch uh, in a couple of years the documentary on Netflix about it. <laughs> I'm literally surprised that we haven't had some weird nerd come in and just start screaming at us for not knowing this and not being true <laughs> Star Wars fans. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, the look. It, lo it looks like there's no feet. It looks like it's just a big slug. Yes, they, they are slugs. They don't have feet. I, I can confirm that. <laughs> I mean, Slugs don't have arms either, do they? But he's got arms. But yeah, it looks like he hasn't got feet at all. Oh, wow. Were there people inside him moving his hands? That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, before they became like, what? I don't want to go on a huge, long job of the hut ran here, but we're already kind of deep into the weeds on this one. <laughs> Uh, why the fuck is it that of all the CGI improvements in all the world, they still cannot make a CGI Jabba or Hut creature look like the original? Every other thing in the world now they can make basically be photoreal. Like, good enough to pass. But for some fucking reason, like, they cannot make Jabba the Hutts look like anything other than the original shitty, uh, like... Fan of, where, uh, a Star Wars re-release CGI one that, that that Lucas had put together. Like they just had them in the most recent Boba Fett or the Boba Fett show, and they looked awful. Like what is it? Like how is that impossible for 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 modern technology to, to render? I've got no idea. Hello, Rick. Thank you for the massive raid. Welcome, Rick viewers, to an extended in-depth rant on Jabba the Hutt CGI. <laughs> oh, and maybe some Blood Bowl. <laughs> We know it's some Skuro. hardcore commentary. <laughs> uh, Skuro choosing that hill to die on, you know, the quality of the CGI of Jabba the Hutt. <laughs> it was amazing. 
terrible, Grigner. I mean, I know, yeah, they look better than the one from 25 years ago. <laughs> That's not saying much. <laughs> oh, dear. This is pretty nice, but the boat, the, the cage is in contact. And, uh, yeah, not bad. Not bad from the Marsalier. The funny thing is now now this is going to be the VOD that you can't put to YouTube because <laughs> Disney will sue you. <laughs> yeah, we mentioned no. Jabba that's instantly demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> The monetas might be, but taking away, you no. Know, Disney is more or less letting people do their cosplays and stuff and all that, that crazy discussion. It's not Gates Workshop. <laughs> That's pretty good, red hair. <laughs> but if you try to make Whoa. any money out of it, get ready. Oh, he's dodged in. He's dodged in on the five plus. A five plus dodge in with a strength five, two Ds in. Thought that was good enough. And it looks like it is. There's diving tackle here, though, so that's not good, is it? This is not the team you want the ball on the ground against. <laughs> I guess it's any elf it's free. team. Is he just going to fall plus away? Oh, he does! Outrageous. Easily. Not a problem in the world. And then fails the pass. He didn't even... Oh, was he passing to this guy? He must have been passing to this guy, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Sure no! Yeah. 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 Okay, there, there it go. is. And that is uh, pretty much a guaranteed score. What a play! Does Lorsley have a reputation that I don't know about? Because there's certainly uh, some commentary <laughs> implying yeah, the, that. The Marseille gets, get salty. Uh, he gets salty and then gets aggressive, yeah. So a lot of people Oh don't dear. Like him. Oh man, Thud, I hope Thud's uh, taking some receipts during uh, this <laughs> turn. Oh dear. Can he hit with a witch? Oh my god, I can't see if the witch can reach. I can't be bothered to count squares. Hello? Why can't I click on anybody? You've been having all sorts of weird Cabal Vision issues yeah. recently, haven't you? Right, it, can, it can reach anyway, because he's doing the blitz. So <laughs> This absolute crap game doesn't work, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, gets the pow. Oh, no, the pow oh, no, plenty of, yeah, there is recovery. Not great. Uh, well, that's the best inbuilt recovery you can have. Yep. Well, except the part that is uh, turn eight. Oh, but he couldn't score anyway, so yeah, that's yeah. fine. Bowling with Dark Elves, huh? Uh, I guess that's a good player to do it to. <laughs> yeah, he's already used his bribe, hasn't he? Not yeah. yeah, that was a great player to use. Oh, that's a. I didn't actually see the dirty player. I didn't see he had a dirty player. Yeah, a dirty game. player and a strength five at seven. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Seven, you yeah. got to take that all day. Yeah. That's certainly not like fouling a a, a, a stunned line elf with uh, your cage corner. No, that would be. I can't imagine who would do anything like that, Scoo. <laughs> <laughs> didn't realize he was my cage corner. Was barely awake. <laughs> Yeah, that was something. It was like, I literally was just like pouring coffee after that play and was like, wait, how's he hitting the ball here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Wow. That was, that was weird, wasn't it? Like, that was a 5 plus dodge in a 2D. That was a very high risk play from Large Thud to stop the score there, but it paid off. 5 plus. If you have a reroll to use, 2D on the ball, I think it's a. Uh, Acceptable if you can stop the score. I mean, it's acceptable, but it's it was still very high risk, right? Because if he failed, he was getting fouled by a dirty player, wasn't he? That was the thing. Like it was fifty five percent in, and it was it was a very lucky stop, really. Overall, I mean, okay, it's only fifty five percent, but still. <laughs> and then the four plus dodge out, it was wild. That, that was I was thinking that I was going to make a pass or something like that from there. Easier than do the you know the risk the failing the dodge and uh, losing the ball. <laughs> this is fine right now, dude. Yeah. Wow. Well, good evening, Marzum. Yes, now uh, the Pro Elves on the fence. Yeah. So now Pro Elves can just can just stall this out for a one 0 win potentially, can't they? Like the team is better. <laughs> sure is, Marzum. I, I, I don't watch the former, and uh, I don't really watch the latter, but I am going to be watching that show tomorrow. I believe my friend wanted to come over and watch it. Mm -hmm. I don't know any of the matches booked for it, though. 
it's a it's a big weekend in chalice matches for me. That's <laughs> yeah. Big <laughs> weekend in blitz pit for me for we, thirty eight uh, minutes. The stream crashed during, so I guess the blitz pit isn't going on YouTube. I guess, which is a good thing for Skuro. <laughs> I don't really care. I, I know exactly what my blood bowl skills and skills are not, <laughs> are and are not. <laughs> Because that was a that was really that was a really rough uh, that was a yeah, the cage corner foul was the, the uh, I mean worst. like I, like it sounds like excuse making but I legitimately was not functional until about turn eleven or twelve yeah. and then even then I was like well what am I gonna do as soon as I like just not being able to set up a rule of five like yeah. which my, one of my I like I couldn't figure it out I was like what did I do wrong building my team that I have to put a white up here and I had this fucking zombie not on the line of scrimmage and I could not understand why and then I lost and then instantly lost my guard because of it, it like, oh, oh, oh. and the rookie the rookie the rookie white was protected and the guard was out there in the corner it was... I was I just could not see the other zombie like I'm like I had it I think I had it selected at one point I was like I don't know why i can't do three zombies I've, it's not like i've never played necro before one sfl with necro once i don't like necro as much as i'm dead and i did i did say to ga5 afterwards that if i had taken this this round seriously at all i would have tried with undead instead but that was just a dumb mistake uh, so uh, yeah Marzum, there, there were five games and i don't know if Kadelik might have posted uh, like who won all of the games, but yeah, there were there were there were five games and five teams went through to the main event and five teams went out before there. Uh, my team qualified already, like as uh, it was done on it was done on uh, what's it called uh, Elo rating, and I'm on the same team as KFog and PC, so those two, <laughs> those two carried oh, that. As they were I was wondering carriers. how some people didn't have to play. Yeah, uh, that's what it was done. On. Yeah. So, so number one, the number one seeded team is uh, is Tri, Dio, and Cruz, which is a pretty insane team. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go, the Marseillais. Looks like he's going to try and come in, doesn't it? Because he's going very, very aggro around the back. Yeah, well, all the, again, all they have to do is uh, keep pushing for more uh, more internet sanctions, and then Cruz doesn't get to play. And, uh, yeah, good that's a go. good point for every everybody else in the in the competition should should try and <laughs> do their part to me. <laughs> oh, they shouldn't. They, shouldn't. They, might, they might not have to do anything the way things are going. I know. Yeah, they shouldn't. We should stay away from that completely. I think. <laughs> I, I, Especially I'm, I'm as you're here, Scoo. So at your request. Yeah, I'm yeah, willing to do you. that at your request. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, there's, yeah, there's, yeah, yeah, we shouldn't, we shouldn't. This is, this is going to be a slow grind to a 1-0, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> there's not much the Dark Elves can even do about this at this point. No. I don't like that apple. No, I don't like that we joke, but never mind. I um, think, uh... On a KO would be better. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. He's yeah. I don't know. It's it's tricky for him, isn't it? Like it's a good player, but this is looking real strong for the pro elves. Yeah, I mean, like literally, what do you even do right now if you're the dark elves? Pray for good dice. Yeah. What good dice? Like, what are you even using your dice on at this point? <laughs> yeah, I don't yeah. know. It has, <laughs> like a six it plus has six every plus blitz. Each time into red. Every blitz is a cast. Yeah. Every blitz is a cast, and then hopefully, well, like by the time he's got five players left, you can, you can. Well, there you go. He's got a removal. <laughs> oh boy, this is going to be some kind of finish. Huh? Bullshit. Yeah. Be mine. Wow, thank you very much, Runban, for the raid. Absolutely glorious. Welcome, Runban viewers. Ah, yeah, Lamaz will be going for the, yeah, the moaning in chat. Yeah, a lot of people are... Uh, I don't think Lamaz has ever moaned to me, but he's probably just diced me every time we played anyway. <laughs> There's a lot of, like, he's a well-known dice mod. A lot of people have got a lot of things to say about Lamaz, but I've, I've never personally experienced any of it. But then, 
you know, very few people go AFK against me either. Like, it's amazing all these people complain about people going AFK, and it's like, I wish people went AFK against me. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, the, the amount of time, the amount of times I've watched, like, Artemis huffing and puffing his way through a game where someone went AFK and racking up, like, 30 SPP in the process. <laughs> like, like, yeah, I get it, it does suck, but also, like, take a win every now and then. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> That's amazing, Albert. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, well, there we go. Tackle mighty, and he makes a removal back. But yeah, that would have been a good, a good apple, wouldn't it, to keep numbers? Yeah, it's a good yeah. point. Good point by uh, like if Lamar's was one nil up, then then appoing this guy for overtime makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? But the fact that La is it's it's zero zero and the Pirels have got the ball, yeah, you probably want to be up wing for like strength this drive because you have to stop him somehow. I don't know how. <laughs> I don't know how. It's pretty ridiculous. He's, he they keeps flinging is. things at the cage though, doesn't he? Like he keeps flinging things into it. Yes, Le Marseilles doesn't have a street ball either, so. It's going to be you know, very difficult to take the ball away from that strength five. Yeah, there's no rackle, is there? He can, he can go in with like an uphill tackle or an uphill wrestle. That's all he's got. Oh, ball base strategies? No, he's not going in. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, neck Um It's interesting. But it, it's, it looks like a large thud is going to win unless a Lamar's does something magical. Uh, and by that, probably rolls magical dice. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, honestly, like, the desperation move here is, okay, I'm going to make you roll a few extra dice, and if one of them is a, a dub skulls or whatever, or, uh, or a double one dodge uh, snake, uh, I've got a shot. <laughs> yeah. You know? And honestly, I can't really fault them. No. The, what happened in the first half was there was a five plus cage dive by this strength five catcher who then two D the ball. So it was a, it was a pretty brainless play <laughs> overall. Like you know it was just it was uh, there wasn't any there wasn't any great like you know tactical moves. It was just charge in, you know get in. Click uh, strength five click ball. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, I don't know, like hanging the edge five out to dry. You might need him. Uh, <laughs> might need him yeah. to get the ball forward. Yeah, it's interesting, isn't it? Because he can pro he can stay in front and still hit that guy, can't he? Pretty much, I yeah. think. So. That's a nice place for the blood yeah. step yeah. diving tackle, isn't it? He's not going after the edge five. No, he's trying to. Well, he's pinning him in a little bit more there, but. Yeah. I know. Oh, man. Oh, here we go. So, yeah, there's, there's diving tackle on the ball. And there's diving tackle around the back, and there's things all around. It's 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 something, isn't it? He's done something. He's achieved something. Oh, and there's double oh, skulls. And he's dubs. So this is what we were talking about. But now he's he's relying on a dodge away from diving tackle. Or a handoff. Yeah, or a handoff. Yeah. And even the two Ds, he doesn't have rerolls for. Maybe he's just content to fight. Yeah. Oh, now he can uh, dodge. Oof, without yeah, without yeah, dodge. Yeah. Without dodge, though, there was tackle there, so that was a huge two plus. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, I thought he was going to hand the ball off. No, yeah. he's just going to sit. Ooh, interesting. Wow. Yeah, you've got to, he's got to go further because this guy's got to cover the back. Yeah. Over these diamond tackles, he's going to try and power him and fail. He'll sidestep to here. No. Okay, he should have sidestep to there, shouldn't he? Because now he's got another chance to power him. Yeah. Didn't like that. Should have sidestep there the first one. Too. Probably shouldn't have hit him at all. She probably should have just gone for the 75% the yeah. dodge. Agreed. 
Wow, he made some good dice rolls there, didn't he? Three plus away <laughs> from tackle, four, two plus oh. away from tackle. All of that without rerolls. Diving tackle makes the dodges <laughs> away from that. Two dodges away from diving tackle. Yeah, he made the six. Oh my god, he made the six on the first one. That is outrageous, isn't it? What a look a dog. What a look a dog that turn, a large thud was. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah, sorry, PK, SK, we, I, I don't know. I, I ban a lot of people when I'm in a bad mood and that, so. <laughs> we. <laughs> At least Jim is honest. Yeah, yeah. Because I just think, you know, if, you, if you're like, you know, like Blood Bowl's hard, isn't it? It's a hard, it is a hard mental game, I think, Blood Bowl. Like, I think it yes. is a hard game mentally. And I think if you're streaming and you're getting pissed off, it's better just to just to ban people, you know, because it's just not worth getting pissed off, is it? That's oh, the I way I look at it. Blitz. Yeah, no, not a blitz. Runs. Oh. Doesn't make the one and nine dodge. <laughs> a large stud makes all of those dice rolls. <laughs> yeah, I, love, I love to be able to read the chat. Yeah. Yeah, it's game. probably not pretty. <laughs> yeah, I banned Dimmy for saying hello once. Using an emote as well, he didn't even type hello. He did the gym hello. <laughs> Dimmy getting banned is a classic in the stream community. <laughs> I banned Skuro once, didn't I once? Oh, that was really bad, so yeah. Yeah, that was really, yeah, that was, like, literally, like, right after I'd sub to you, too. Yeah, yeah. It was, like, the, like within enough time that I was like, all right, I guess I'm just going to get my sub money back, and like, yeah. you only have, like, a two-hour window to do that. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's, been some, there's been some real bad bannings, but, you know. Well, there you go. There's a chance for the Dark Elves to score back. I'm surprised he should have... He didn't... Uh, he I wasn't see, able uh, to stall it. Yes, the large suits have yeah. the tools to be able to stall. Yeah, that's not great. Yeah, I thought for sure he could have got the stall. Then. I mean, Dark Elves struggle with uh, one turns, but the uh, two turns mm. are perfectly doable. <laughs> He has very fast players. He has a yeah. movement aid, the uh, Blitzer, uh, and the Witches, and the Blitzer, so for two turns. Yeah, and this Edge 5 now looks a great, uh, looks a great uh, Apple, because he's got Edge 5 to like collect yeah. the ball, stay out of range, and then distribute it to oh. the correct player. Flashback to what Skuro said about Edge 5 picking up the ball clean. Mm. <laughs> in the first half. The problem is passing it, actually. Pa you know, he can't go for the, the often yeah. used, like, you know, get some scoring threats and then pass because you just literally can't pass over the heads of catches because they will almost certainly intercept it. So, yeah. really don't want to pass over a catcher's head. Oh, he got it that time. When he's start opening with a pass, that, that, I think that's kind of fair enough. Yeah. Because, yeah, he, do, he doesn't want to... <laughs> Strength 5 dude just going to do it all himself. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Shouldn't we? This isn't making a gap. What? what no. Wait, what's happening? That was pretty crazy. That was a play. Oh, I think he through. blitzed the wrong player. Yeah, he should, he should like hit I, somebody first so that there was yeah. a gaping hole instead of it not being a gaping hole. I think he was going to miss the guard, the uh, Blodger. Ride or die on the two pluses right now. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's worked out fine, but the three two yeah. is pretty horrible. And there it is, full cage, scoring range. We're we gonna see another uh, five plus cage die. Oh, well, we're gonna certainly see a double one <laughs> into yeah. Kaz. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> boy, howdy! I was well, like, I feel like the end result's pretty good there for Lamar Soleil, but there's definitely a way he could have done that better. <laughs> yes, I wonder if we'll just see the five plus dodging again. <laughs> I, think, I, I think we're definitely gonna see that, yeah. <laughs> five oh, that's plus only dodging. a. Uh, yeah, no, it's still two die. Yeah, it is. Yeah, five plus dodging. Roll a full pal. Bob's your uncle. Well, now he can't. Oh, well, he's not doing it. Yeah, he, blo he blocked all his ways to do it, didn't he? 
Molest the cage. You're really trying to make that a thing, aren't you, Dio? <laughs> <laughs> that maybe shouldn't be. That maybe shouldn't be a blood ball term. <laughs> yeah, it probably, it probably shouldn't. Annoy the cage with uh, side of So you can you can go back then forward then score right one two three yeah. four five six seven GFI GFI go the school yeah. roll path that's what he needs yeah. to do. <laughs> it's the power. Yeah, it worked out for me too. <laughs> did. He, got, he got the power this time though. You didn't get the power, did you? Yeah, no, that's Ooh, true. Yeah. Oof. Oof. I almost I almost ran out of time during that too. That was rough. <laughs> I was just like Okay, take a breath, take a breath during the decision, then click the end zone for fuck's sake. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Greelius, really that's the thing, like it's really bad, like anyone asks for advice and like you wanna say sidestep and like so like as as a non German person you always just do that and then you're like <laughs> every time you've typed it as an English person you're like, Oh yeah. oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that means something else, doesn't it? <laughs> so I try to type sidestep out in full whenever I can, but it is so much easier just to just to do it the other way. Um no, no, I'm because you got the reroll to use, haven't you? So I think it was I think it was it was better to add the GFI just because you've got the reroll to use. So yeah. And uh, here we are on extra time, which I think is a gift for on a large tooth to La Marse, yes. Mm. Because I think he could have been stole uh two thousand sixteen. Yep, I really think he should have done. He should have done. Yeah, for could sure. and should have done. Yeah. But he's got another chance, hasn't he? He's got another chance, a uh, large thud, so not punished yet for his lack of stalling. <laughs> and he has really, really strong player, so if that strength five gets the ball again, it's going to be very difficult for La Marseillaise to be able to create a chance. Yeah, Proel's, Proel's definitely up there as like one of the hardest teams to stop to turning, aren't they? Because they've got the uh, nerves of steel, so you can't even like you know surround a scoring threat and stuff. Like, uh, it's funny because like obviously Wood Elves are quite good because they're really fast and they've got a leap, and then Kiz level good because they've got a leap as well. So they're, they're they're a really hard one to do and the diving catch and everything and stuff. So like they they could do things, but uh, yeah, the nerves of steel and Edge Four all around is. Really fast. The Proel's definitely one of the best two turning teams. He doesn't even have to two turn either, does he? You can score at any turn. It's uh, very likely that a large that wins. Yeah. The odds are on uh, his favour. But this is the challenge where odds comes to die. <laughs> <laughs> And he's got two re-rolls, and yeah, he doesn't have to score in like two or three. Like, when they can score any time they want, elves are basically undefendable, right? Yeah. They sometimes get in trouble trying to stall till turn eight, but if they if they can score at any time, it's just it's almost impossible to defend against them. Tit for tat here for three turns, isn't there? Yeah, just, it's just really <laughs> hard because the Marseille yeah. has got to try and defend absolutely everything, and a large yes, foot can just can just poke a little bit, and then if there's a yeah. slight gap, that's it. He's gone and it's lost. It's just horrible. It's just uh, getting a couple catches on a uh, scoring range, and uh, that's it. That's uh, very complicated. Yeah. Because it's going to be a 2 plus pass, 2 plus catch anyway. They have nerves still. Yep. Yeah. 
<laughs> no, how good the French are at defending. Jeebus. The Royals haven't taken any any removals, have they? And uh, I think they got a KO. Well, oh yeah, okay. Well, no, no cars then. Sorry, but um, there's been two cars for the uh, Dark Elves, and then all those KOs that came back. Yeah. Oh, he's rolled a one. Maybe he didn't need to make that. Doesn't re-roll it. There isn't really a weakness though, is there? So He hasn't lost yet. The team says uh, Pro Elves, but it's looking like an undead drive. <laughs> one one square at a time hit the ball move up call yeah. it a day I mean that's what every team wants to do isn't it <laughs> you know yeah yeah, yeah it's, true, true. it's just that these guys the whole team can go anywhere they want <laughs> like two yeah. movement nine guys <laughs> movement eight everyone's edge forward it's like it's crazy how it can just it can just change whenever it wants mm -hmm. Giving a free hit on that uh, that elf there it doesn't seem like you'd want to do that. No, but if if he two free hits, yeah. If, yeah. if he does, he, he's got to move someone to assist, or he's or it takes up the strength four, doesn't it? So yeah, yeah. yeah I fair. guess that was his thinking. And if he gets too weak over here, he'll just plow through. It would be yeah, happy chuckles. That's the rules in Blood Bowl twenty twenty, isn't it? They, it's just a, an entire extra half. Which is uh, an interesting idea. Yeah, it just takes the blitz in anyway. It does kind of favour bash teams more, though. I guess it being a full half, right? Because you can, you can then, if you lose the toss, you can just kill them and, uh, like, you know, you can kill them and then maybe counter score. Like, yeah. Peaky one D instead of dodging away there yeah. might give him a bit too much space on the uh, right, and it looks like he's gonna take it. Yep. Yep. He's... And uh, here I want to make the point that maybe carrying the ball on the string five is not as. Uh... Oh, and the removal. Uh, okay. I re I retire the thing because mighty blow. Uh... I don't know. It wasn't with almighty. It was with almighty blow. Because that guy, you know, the strength five can just open a space by himself. He doesn't need any assist. So you have an extra player to, you know, yeah. make a screen or put on the cage or whatever. Yeah, I mean, it gives a lot of peace of mind, you know, having a strength five blocks carrying the ball. That's the thing. Like, oh, that is the thing. Okay. Isn't he? He's got this strength four tackle, a dodge tackle. So if you carry on anybody else, this guy can maybe dodge in and get you, can't he? So yeah, well, that's, that's basically ball game. <laughs> it's it's it is it is like the whole ball center thing, though, isn't it? You know, like yeah, he he is absolutely the best guy to have the ball on, but also he's a good guy to be doing something else, isn't he? Yeah, doing a blitz, you know, to open in a space, and that's it. Uh, you save a lot of players that you can move and reposition. Strength five L's should be banned. Yes, I'll know. People who use strength five L's are just disgusting people. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Every single one I know is a terrible human. And also, you're shooting human in a very broad term. <laughs> Especially the high elves. Yeah, they're the worst ones, obviously. <laughs> Everyone knows that. Because they're so smug about it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Poor Jimmy thinking his strength five mighty blow was going to be the best elf on the <laughs> cap this season, and suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> the 40th strength five elves game, you know, <laughs> the asteroid market on the rise on the elf community. <laughs> and the thing was, I never even got the hope of that because Daedalus was like just instant, wasn't it? He just instantly had a, a blodge leap, mighty blow, tackle, strength five, edge five. <laughs> it was like it's <laughs> insane, <laughs> absolute insanity. Elf uh, Daedal had so there was, but then, but then, yeah, and then there was this strength five, my strength five. Two string fours on the uh, on the wood elves like this. It's so crazy. Strength up on this team like the amount of strength elves has been insane this season. And uh, if you don't know, uh, that strength five high elf uh, player is going to be playing what Monday at eight p.m. Seven p.m. UTC. Seven, UTC. Okay. Glorious versus the man, the myth, the legend, Rick Reckless. What's he taking to that game? <laughs> A Kislev player or two? 
1200 TB Kislev. Amazing. Yeah. I can't wait to see how he dices you. Yep, I mean, it's very easy. He's going to have a wizard and an arch 5 catcher, so uh. that that is it. Um, so, yeah, it, you know, if he gets the crucial turn, and the, if he gets the dice on the crucial turn, he can, he can absolutely win. I think uh, for that uh, game, the soundtrack should be the song from the Benny Hill show. You know, the one that went... <laughs> or from the 80s, from Benny Hill. Yeah. Come on, guys, don't really remember it. Jimmy, you have I mean, to I know exactly. Ben Hill. What, yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. Yeah, the, yeah. the song. The yeah, song I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it, for me. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, know, I know the song. <laughs> the song, because that's going to be the kids left running around, jumping all over the place. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why this happened, but when I tried to recount the song in my head, I got La Cucaracha stuck in it. <laughs> <laughs> so that's going to be there all day. <laughs> <laughs> Do the flipping song. Well, Benny Hill died years ago, so yes, he got very cancer. <laughs> Flip me. You don't get more cancer than that, do you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Right, we're live. I've just like realized a... we're live now. Look at that. They're still playing. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I was wondering why there are bigger lulls in our talking. Yeah, right. I'm going to get some food. <laughs> Be right back. <laughs> Take your time because there's probably the messages writing something on the chat now. Yeah, we're live. We're at the last exciting part of this game before it's over and, lo and a large thud wins. Jimmy has just gone off to make a sandwich. Well, there's still time for kicks. Not much. Oh, look at that. He was able to get someone in front. Sidestep, uh, diving tackle. Not a bad player to have out there. Maybe needs to be one more over. Yeah. He needs Literally to... Literally just a... There is... Uh, yeah, there all it is. All right, there. all right. That's, yes, that's like a little more than one over. Yeah. <laughs> well, he can't win with that's just good, a two-plus it... catch now, can he? Yeah. He hasn't got a leap. So he would have to power this guy pretty much. But he's got he's got the night ball right here, hasn't he? I guess you I guess you dodge this guy and hit him and then if you power him you scope. It's pretty that easy. Sounds like isn't a plan. And now we enter the last three minutes of the last four seconds. Okay. It'd be a four plus dodge. Kicks to the diving tower. He also doesn't have to score this turn. He can just. He might have a cutback here, especially if this fails. Nope. Yeah. Uh, that's a little harder now. I think you try though. I think you try. I think you nail this guy, and then see. You, yeah. you, you know, you dodge. Hit this guy, see if you power him, and then yeah. do the rest of your turn, depending on what happens. Last seconds of a Blood Bowl turn are like the last seconds of a bomb in an action movie. <laughs> <laughs> like five minutes. Yep. Like, you might as well go for the score, right? Because you, you don't have to dodge it. Like, you're going to have to dodge or something. So, like, well, maybe you don't, maybe you could just blitz, but then you don't get power. You'd have to hit him, which you can't do like unless you do everything safely i guess hit him then hit him and then blitz him then you can do everything more safely so i guess you could do that because his team is better and he is men up so maybe you do just do the totally safe thing if the wrestle guy hits him he hits him and then he blitzes him like but then you need the power to be able to do that so like you're gonna probably have to roll dice so if you're gonna have to roll dice okay yeah hit him first but then you need to at least Mm, don't know. I don't like. I don't like that so much. Oh, the hit with the guy will wrestle what will be better, you know, because if you get a bot down to wrestle. Yeah, I, 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 don't, I don't like hitting this guy because you've got two players on the ball, and it's really hard to hit this one. So, so if you power this guy, you're okay. You can blitz away, but like. You don't want to make a, 
<laughs> yeah. If you blitz this guy, you, then you do no one in thirty six that you can lose the game on, right? Like basically, and and so you either you either go for this one in thirty six and this one in thirty six is to score, or you or you go absolutely as safe as possible. Um, whereas this seems to be in between those two. We can just run back. Yeah, but how does he do it totally safely? That's the thing. He, he just can't because now he's going to have to dodge with dodge. There was one, and he's going to have to do another dodge with dodge as well. So, and if this is a one in thirty-six, he's—I guess he could just punch. He can just punch. Maybe. Yeah, that's what I. Yeah, I think he's just going to hit him. There yeah, just realised he can just punch. Yeah, he's got two yeah. guards. Cause he can because he can complete. It'll be a base cage, but not. He's just a, done a one D. He's just done a flipping one D. He's going to try and win it right now. I can hand off to this one. Oh no, he's got down tackle. Yeah, he's just going to. Okay, well, he's, that yeah, was he's terrible. He's going to go score. Okay. Makes the first one. Oh! 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 Here we go! Oh! He makes it. Game That's over. It. Yikes! <laughs> Didn't like that. <laughs> well, something to be said about putting the game to bed, though. Yeah, but I mean, there was easy ways to do it. That's what I think. I think it wasn't the right yeah. way to, to to do it. Yeah. But worked. I think I probably would have shied away from scoring that turn and gotten myself into more trouble. So I actually don't <laughs> mind that. But yeah, you're right. There's definitely a, a lower lower dice chance to clear that and get the the ball in. Yeah. But yep. Congratulations, a large thud and uh, <laughs> suck on that Lamar's is all. No, I don't. I don't know Lamar's at all. So commiserations, Lamar's. <laughs> And uh, you know that definitely the better team won. I mean, the the Proyles were were a really really much better team. Um, yes, they were very well developed. Yep. So there you go. Thank you very much, Skuro and Fami. Absolutely glorious having you guys in the booth. Thank you so much. Of course, it's always a pleasure. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>